Have you ever wondered where passenger trains go at the end of their daily service? The answer isn't as simple as you might think. While some trains are stored on special tracks at larger passenger stations that serve as traffic hubs, these setups often lack the full depot facilities necessary for comprehensive train maintenance and servicing. This leads us to the concept of the train depot, known by several names depending on the region, such as rail maintenance facility, traction maintenance depot, or technical passenger station. In this video, we'll focus on what we commonly refer to as the train depot. If you're watching this video, you're clearly someone who values learning and understanding how things work behind the scenes, which is why we think you'll be interested in Imprint. Instead of filling your brief moments of downtime with mindless scrolling, why not dive into learning something new and engaging? With Imprint, we're exploring a range of topics from philosophy to psychology, transforming these small windows of time into enriching learning sessions. We've been particularly enjoying insights into productivity from James Clear, the author of Atomic Habits, and fascinating details on human focus and behavior from the groundbreaking work ADHD 2.0 by Dr. Edward M. Hallowell and Dr. John J. Rady. Imprint is not just another educational app. It's an innovative platform that turns complex concepts into easy to digest lessons. Its visually rich courses and interactive content are designed based on the science of learning, ensuring that you not only learn, but retain knowledge. From building learning habits to exploring in-depth courses on various subjects, Imprint helps you grow at your own pace and ensures your learning sticks. If you find this as exciting as I do and are curious to try it out, Imprint is offering a free 7-day trial exclusively to our viewers. Plus, you'll get a 20% discount on an annual plan. Just click the link in the description or scan the QR code on your screen to get started. Now, back to our main topic. A train depot is a specialized facility where passenger trains are parked when they're not in operation. Designing a train depot is a complex task that requires careful consideration of the existing fleet and the planned activities within the depot. As a result, no two train depots are exactly alike. One challenge many railways face today is that the basic design of these facilities has remained largely unchanged over the past century. In many cases, original sites and buildings are still in daily use, making it difficult to adapt to modern maintenance systems. However, new depots are being constructed, particularly in countries like China, which often surprises us with cutting-edge facilities for high-speed rail. A recent example is a depot in Tianfu City, which spans an impressive 62,000 square meters. Another notable facility is the already famous train depot in Wuhan, which is, you might recognize it from this image. The location of train depots is crucial for efficient train operations. If a depot is located far from a city's main passenger station, moving a train to the station for an early morning service can occupy valuable track capacity without serving its primary purpose, transporting passengers. Therefore, proximity to main lines and easy access to service tracks are essential considerations. Inside a train depot, a variety of essential activities take place to ensure the trains are in optimal condition for service. One of the primary activities is internal and external cleaning. Internal cleaning involves preparing the passenger compartments to ensure a comfortable and hygienic environment for travelers. Externally, trains undergo thorough washing to remove dirt and grime, maintaining the aesthetic appeal of the rolling stock. Also, sewage management is another critical aspect, with facilities dedicated to decanting and processing waste from train systems. If the trains are not in use, they are parked in the stabling areas that are most often outdoors without constructed sheds. Typically, trains return to the stabling facility at the end of service and until they are required again. The division and amalgamation of trains are rail operations performed within the depot, this process involves rearranging train sets to meet service requirements, which can include coupling or decoupling carriages to form different train configurations as needed. Regular inspection and maintenance are another fundamental task conducted at train depots. 
Inspections cover a wide range of components, from the undercarriage to the electrical systems, ensuring that every aspect of the train meets safety and operational standards. This includes detailed inspections of the bogies, wheels, traction motors and pantographs. Maintenance activities range from routine servicing to addressing specific issues identified during inspections. Modern depots are equipped with advanced workshops and inspection lines for more intensive maintenance tasks that require train lifting. Thus, these facilities are equipped with overhead cranes or with synchronized jacks for lifting entire train sets, allowing maintenance crews to access and service components like bogies and underslung equipment efficiently. Certain workshops are equipped with bogey drop pits that enable the removal and replacement of bogies without the need to lift the entire train, streamlining the maintenance process. An essential part of the maintenance regime is wheel profiling, conducted using underfloor wheel lathes that are installed on the pit under maintenance track that reprofile the wheel without having to dismount the wheel set from the vehicle. On another hand, in certain depots are utilized the milling machines for this purpose. The main aim of the process is to restore the roundness of wheels, which is crucial for smooth and safe operation, particularly at high speeds. Proper wheel profiling prevents eccentric loads that can lead to mechanical failures of trains and thus prevent serious accidents from happening. The operations control center within a depot is the nerve center coordinating all depot activities and ensuring the efficient movement of trains in and out of the facility. This center manages traction power control systems and monitors all operations to guarantee safety and efficiency. Based on all these functions and the planned daily throughput of trains, depots are designed with an appropriate layout. This includes the number and length of tracks, with adequate access walkways for operating and engineering staff, multiple parks for track arrangements, and complex signal and safety systems with automatic train protection. These elements must be carefully integrated into the depot's track design, supporting the entire operation through facilities like stabling areas, workshops, wash plants, specialized equipment, test tracks, and more. As you can see, train depots are vital components of the railway operation process, designed to ensure that passenger trains are maintained, safe, and ready to serve the public efficiently. Each depot is tailored to meet the specific operational needs of its fleet, incorporating modern technology and designed to optimize maintenance and operational efficiency. The importance of these facilities cannot be overstated as they play a crucial role in the reliability and safety of train services. If you enjoyed this video and want to support the continued production of informative content like this, please consider subscribing to our channel and becoming a member of our community. You can join us on Patreon for exclusive content or support us through YouTube membership. Your support helps us keep producing high-quality videos and exploring fascinating railway topics. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.